Morning, welcome to the next podcast of Andy Collier Talks Cricket Memorabilia. Now, before we get started on uh, bits about Clary Grimmick, because the uh, book's turned up from James Merchant this week, I'd just like to add a bit more information on this lovely illustration here that was in the um, London the Industry News. Um, and I had some information through from uh, Douglas Gorman. Thank you very much, Douglas, if you're watching. Um, this was actually uh, printed or, or um, put in the London Illustrated News. As I say, it's not a print, so uh, but it was it was uh, published in the uh, Illustrated London News on the 18th of September 1880, and it was uh, drawn by Charles Robinson, um, who actually had a brother you might know, Heath Robinson. His name well, who's uh, used to draw all those funny machinery things. So that was his famous brother, but um, he was obviously an accomplished artist, was Charles Robinson. So I'd just like to thank um, Douglas Gorman for a bit more information on this lovely print of this uh, test match. Thank you very much. Right, so let's just go into the Clary Grimmett actually. So this week, the cricket world of Clary Grimmett arrived from James Merchant in Australia which is a cracking book. It's uh, one of those books you want to read. Plenty of pictures and, and a lot of information. So well done to James on that. Nice publication. This one's number seven of uh, 50, I think he done. So I'm quite pleased to have a, of this uh, limited edition run. So there's a nice bit there from James, number seven. Um, so that's a nice addition to the collection. And then... I just want to just mention this Victor Richardson book by John here. Um, I've got halfway through through it, John. Fascinating book, I tell you. Um, really interesting stuff in there. Mingled up with some uh, fascinating photographs as well. It's a cracking book. So I think you can get hold of John um, through the Facebook page. And it's well worth the money it's uh, asking for. So well worth that. Well done, John. Um, so, just going to go now into the bits on Clary Grimmett, I thought, seeing as we had a book on Clary Grimmett this week. Obviously toured over here three times with the Australians. This is the, I've showed the 1926 photograph before, but this is the, uh, this is what I'm doing now with my postcard of ships. This is the 1926, 16th Australian 11, 126. Okay, it's on there. This is a Tranto. Lovely postcard that one beautifully signatures so quite pleased to have that with uh, Clary's first trip over here and to go with that there's a nice 1926 uh, postcard here this one here this one's uh, which one's this this is Bolland so that's a nice one of uh, this Clary here Clary is John Clary's there next to his mate Arthur Maley so there he is so that's a nice postcard there from 1926 but something else from 1926 was the trip home this is the SS Montrose from Liverpool this is a menu on board the ship so it's a nice uh, unfortunately not signed it has got the possible Arthur Maley drawing on the top there I'm quite pleased to have that in the collection on the way home in 1926 and then a few, quite a few other bits and pieces um, we'll go to 1930 now and of course he came over, another opportunity to show this little beauty, came over on the Orford with the rest of the team there, 1930. Nice one there coming through Sydney Hedge as are from Orford there. And then a few bits and pieces here from Clary, not a particularly good condition flicker book there from Clary. You can see that there, that gives you a good indication of how he used to spin the ball. I think it's googly as well on this one. Quite a nice little flicker book on there. Not a very good uh, display there, but anyway. And then this lovely 1930 um, Clary Grimmett little diary here. This is from the Ambassadors Club in London. Um, Ambassador Diary for 1930. There we are. It's a nice little thing, little pocket one there. And you've got Clary Grimmett on the top there. On the front, rather, it's got with sincere good wishes 
on the general committee the ambassador club greetings christmas 29 new year 30. that's quite a nice little rarity there from the 1930 tour well nice and cool she had his uh place on quite a few cig cigarette cards this one is uh 1930 this one uh 28 i think i'm oh, sorry this one here with all these there's clary there image of clary real photograph and these are uh, major trapkin and co on the back there so a full set of those which is quite nice and then he came over again obviously 1930 um there's the 1931 i did it out here just a minute ago always happens when you're trying to find it and there's clary there with the 1931s there that's clary these are um quickest 1930 john player these ones and you've got clary in this one here which i think a 1928 one 1934 beg your pardon and there's clary for the 1934 set there quite a nice is uh, victoria cap um yeah very nice uh, it's a bit too I'm talking about South Australia I'm talking about, I beg your pardon. Uh, so that's a nice one there for the 1934 one, so very nice too. So we'll continue on now, we've got a uh, nice one, the postcard there, 1930. There, that's a 1930 team, I'm playing Jaeger. So that's that one there, nice one there. The one I haven't shown you yet, is this, uh, this is a 1928 match at Adelaide, this is... Uh, um, Archie Jackson's debut. This was given to Alexander Hall Ruthen. Lovely mini bat in its own little oak presentation case. Clary signed down there. Let me see, one, two, three, four, five, six down, seventh down there. Clary Grimmett there. That's the Australian team at Adelaide. And there's the England touring party on the other side. So a lovely mini bat there from Archie Jackson's 164 debut. And uh, what else have we got here? We've got, uh, which one's this? This is 19, oh, that's a 26 one. So we've got 1934 here. This is 1934. Postcard of, uh, with Clary Grimmett there. This is uh, a real photograph produced by Photo Work Bridge House. It's a nice one there. And obviously on the way home, you've got uh, 1930, a nice one there with, uh, Tammy Sunny, nice and bold there, on the way home on the orange say. And then we've got, what else have we got here? We've got a few programs here. I'll just show you this one first, which doesn't get much of an airing, to be honest. This is a nice large 1934 signed photograph there of the Australian team. This one's a Sasha, London. I think he's a London Suffolk Street Pall Mall. So there we are, not lovely, full size signed 1934 team photograph there. And then while we're on 34, we're just going to go with another ship one. Ship one. There's the Orford there, 1934. That's a nice signed ship there. 1934. Obviously, coming over on the uh, Orford, we've got this lovely 1934 menu, which I've shown before. And we've got Clary signing nicely there. And um, what's he on there? He's on the just above the Saragus Sauce McGraw, which was the uh, Davis Cup player. So, nice menu there from uh, the Orford, Orient Line. Nice thing there, and then of course we've got some uh, nice tall brochures there. Clary is there, look, there's Clary. Nice photograph there of Clary. 34, got 38 one I just remembered, but there's a 1934 one there. So you've got a pin picture of him in this one probably. Um, Quite an interesting one, this one. It gave you a nice uh, few photographs of the uh, um, body line team coming back home over the Rockies and stuff. So it's quite a nice uh, program to have this one. And I can't find Clary just for the purpose of it. Barnet. 
Oh, well, I might know about this club is in there somewhere. And we've got this uh, lovely Test Certainties 9829 by Monty Noble. All the Test Certainties and possibilities in there. Um, there's Clary there, look. Clary on there, so quite a nice one there from Clary. All with Clary, and then we've got the uh, All About the Australians, this one, 1926. Gregory on the front there. Read the Daily Mail, it's got on the back there. It's got a nice one. And the last one here is uh, the Alcas Cricket Guide, there, which is a nice one. Um, just going to flip through this while I can quickly and find sort of a newspaper type effort. This one, and we have Clary. Where do we have Clary? Oh, the old Clary. Uh, oh, again, he's uh, oh, there he is. I thought he was there somewhere. There he is, Clary, just over here. So that's a nice one there. Compiled by the old boy. There's the Argos. And there we are for the cricket scores on the back there. So quite pleased with a little collection involving Clary Grimmett. So that's more or less wrapped that up for this week. Um, so um, we'll uh, have another chat next week. Hope you've enjoyed this one. See you next time. Cheers.